Hi guys, welcome back to Daniel's Tech World on YouTube. My name is Daniel Rosal. This is a YouTube channel where I upload uh, videos about technology, especially stuff to do with audio and video editing. A couple of months ago, I uploaded some videos to my YouTube channel where I needed to do a little bit of uh, voice modulation in order to preserve the anonymity of uh, certain individuals and I did that using Audacity. Now there's a few uh, tutorials and how-to videos out there on YouTube about how to do some kind of uh, changing of your voice. Now I'm using Audacity on Ubuntu Linux and we don't have uh, programs like Voice Mod on Windows. To the best of my knowledge I haven't come across any program that really allows you to kind of totally change your voice especially uh, my voice for instance has kind of a characteristic accent and I haven't found on Audacity any kind of plugin I don't even know if such a thing would be possible to completely change your voice what you can do instead is pitch modulation and using pitch modulation is a pretty common technique when you're doing interviews with uh, anonymous subjects so you know commonly uh, producers and documentaries will use stuff like silhouette lighting in order to hide or obscure or black in the face of uh, the interview subject they need to keep anonymous and then for the voice they'll do basic pitch modulation and that's what I'm going to do in this video so in a few seconds um, I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep speaking but I'm going to uh, change the audio using those effects in audacity I'm going to do pitch modulation I'm going to add a bit of refurb and these are the results so this is my voice after doing the pitch modulation in Audacity and uh, for the sake of allowing there to be an audio sample I'm going to keep speaking but I'm going to speak a little bit slower so that it's easier to hear me. Now with pitch modulation you're able to modulate the pitch downwards in order to kind of get that like Darth Vader voice going on like I'm doing currently. You don't want to go too far because if you go very very low down in pitch it's going to be more difficult to understand. So if you're trying to use Audacity pitch modulation to disguise the identity of your subject, usually the idea is to modulate the pitch enough that their natural voice is uh, made impossible to hear, but not too much that they're hard to understand. Now you can also go in the other direction, which I'm going to do now, and adjust the pitch upward. As you change the pitch upward, you're going to be moving towards the chipmunk effect. And if you go all the way, you're really gonna sound like a chipmunk. Now for the purpose of anonymization, usually uh, people use, it's kind of just a tradition, when was the last time you were watching a documentary with some kind of a crime mobster and in order to make him uh, anonymous uh, they made his voice like a chipmunk that would kind of defeat the purpose and sound look and sound pretty ridiculous so commonly it's downwards pitch modulation uh, you can also do a few things like add reverb as i've done here that kind of adds a bit of a dramatic effect and uh, simulates being in a uh, big room even if you're just recording the video like i am in something like a home office. Anyway, uh, this should be enough, I think, to uh, give you an idea for some of the effects uh, you can achieve using Audacity to change the voice of yourself or uh, someone you've interviewed. Uh, if you know of more effects and distortion effects in Audacity that can achieve this kind of a effect, uh, please let me know because occasionally uh, this kind of stuff does come in handy. Thanks for watching and if you want to get more videos about audio and tech technology, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you for watching the video.